is good, yo. It's your boy Todd back here with another video. And in this video today, guys, we're going to be watching my game versus Infamous in what I do believe was the Elite Eight of Splash's $300 Players Lounge tournament that did happen last night. Now, here's the deal, guys. Infamous, one of the best guys on PlayStation, you know, has beat Splash recently. He's kind of been, I don't want to say running the streets, but he's been, you know, probably top five on the PlayStation console, no doubt about it. So definitely a tough opponent, but this is the best of the best. His Minute versus my Minute, his Yao versus my Yao. The best of the best versus the best of the best with the, with the best teams as well. Now, before we dive any further into that, if you are new to my channel, man, make sure you guys do smash that subscribe button. Also going to be talking over it and kind of breaking it down as we do go through it today. So, without further ado, guys, let's see what does happen and just kind of how the game does go in general. Now, obviously, guys, this was my one of, one of my first times running a new first possession of the game. Hold up. Did you guys see this? First possession of the game. Look at Manu, man. Manu from 30. Bang. Big Manu bowl starting the game off right. Next, we're in a full court press. This should be eight seconds, but he makes a kind of crazy pass right there. And I'm not going to lie. After this, I was like, uh-oh. Uh oh, you know, if you're going to be knocking down shots like that, it's going to be a long game for me, to say the least, man, because I uh, I don't normally knock down shots like that. And Impy did play interesting, right? Because he, his defense, like, was kind of help defense. Like, it was, it was definitely interesting the way he was playing defense. I kind of got bailed out right there. I didn't deserve to score in that possession. It's pretty good defense. I mean, what am I What am I honestly supposed to do here? I'm what I like to break down film. Okay. Maybe switch on to Ben because he got stunned. That's probably what I should have done. But when I saw that, I thought I was done. I honestly thought at this stage I was going to lose. Because, I mean, this dude has been cooking me. And his defense is, is stout, man. You guys see that rotation. It's an easy one. Yao comes in. He rotates to the corner. It's not necessarily a hard rotation. But he's got his help on. And uh, and it's, it's interesting. I know at this point, okay, he's three hunting heavy. If I can make it difficult for him and not give up the initial shot with TT, we might be able to get some stops. Seven seconds of the clock. There's no way I should give up a bucket. I mean, again, I feel like I got to on ball more. Like that's my, that's my big notice right now is eventually I got to on ball and make a, make a read, right? Make, make that right read. Cause a lot of people on my comment section is always like, yo, Ty, you off ball. Well, if you're up against a good opponent, they know how to beat it. Big Yao, this should be an easy bucket. Thank you for cutting, Tim Thomas. Lovely. I definitely wanted you to cut right there. Definitely. Now, I am down for early on in the game, so I need to make sure I get a stop here. Like, I, there's no excuses. Got to get a stop here. X switch that. I got a lot of height. X switch it back. This is great defense, and we got a stop. I can't play any better defense than that. If I can put him in the rim here, I'm going to do exactly that. Now, I remember early on in this game, I wasn't super comfortable offensively. It took me a little bit. And so I was just trying to stay stay the course, right? But it's hard to stay the course when he's shooting that and making it the majority of the time. Thank goodness he missed it. Opening up the door for me to get back in the game. Manu over Yao, not the best shot, but big Yao at a board. Okay, let's relax, Ty. Let's relax here, Ty. Out to Ben. Green. Gotta be green. And I'm missing. I'm missing with hero Ben Simmons. 99 three ball. Unacceptable. That's good D. That's good D, boy. That's good D. For I, if I can make him settle for that, I'll live with it. Hey, Ben. It's green. Another miss. That's a good shot, though. It's a shot I'll live with because once I get comfortable and in a flow, I'll green shots like that. Got to switch early. In a situation like that, got to switch early. It's good D. It's good D. It's good D. No way I give up a bucket here. This is great defense. No way I give up a bucket on this possession. There's no way. This is perfect D. 
Perfect defense, even the rotation from the corner. Can't ask for better defense. Ben on the jam, boom, defense leading to offense. Again, good defense. He's not in any sort of flow right now. It's one we got to take advantage of. Got to find a way to take advantage of this. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Sometimes it's not always going to be pretty. And that's okay. We got a bucket. So we're, I mean, honestly, we were down 9 to 5, I believe. And now it's 9 to 11. So we're on a big time run here. We bait that. And it's really our defense that's taken over the game. Offensively, I haven't been good. And then we get blessed right there. We're on an 8-0 run, getting blessed. We've got Algo. But it all starts with our defense being great. That's where it all starts. And he's uncomfortable right now. Even in the full court setting. Ooh, could have been mine. He's uncomfortable. We're good. That's good, D. I mean, come on, man. I'm on an 8-0 run, and he's greening that. MP is not phased at all. Hey, TT. Hey, TT, back to Yao. Yup. All it did, all it took me was a little bit of getting into rhythm. And I'm there. Got to get a stop here. Stop and a score. We could go up a ton heading into the second quarter. Stop and score. Stop and score. Good D. Stay up. Good D. Manu. Could have been my block. Could have been my block. Got to get a score here, though. No doubt about it. Got to get a score. Got to get a bucket here. Got to. Manu. Bang! And that's that's what you got to know if you have Manu. He can shoot over people. So I see right here, his Manu pinched too much. I can shoot over that 10 times. I can't. Green, 7%. One second on the clock, can't give up a bucket. And he throws it off the backboard. Throws it off the backboard. So not only did I not go down or only up two, I have a chance to score here once again. And guess what, guys? Put Big Z into the game. And he'll do the rest. Shooting over him for a good shot. We were up to seven seconds left to go in the quarter. We end the first quarter up eight. Headed to the second quarter here, we're up eight after being down nine to five. So if you think about it and break it down, we are on a 17 to five run. That doesn't just happen all the time. That's a crazy run. And, and it really all started with our defense. Can't get crowded, had to jump. It's good D though, it's good D. Play two at one. If you have to foul, you have to. It's fine. Yup, another another steal. Defense leading to offense. Good, yo. Kitch. Mm, I tried walking back. I, that was a little bit of a front run right there because I normally don't be doing that. This possession is going absolutely nowhere. That's the one thing I noticed right now. This possession is going nowhere. Thank gosh he reached in there. I always struggle with free throws, though. I don't know why or how, but I can never green free throws. Did get the second one to go with Yao, though, thankfully. Game's all about getting stops. Let's see. Gotta leave him open for mid-range, I guess. So we'll take what we can get there. I, it's not necessarily what I want, but it is what it is. I'll take him making a tough mid-range jump shot. Hey, Jokic. Y'all see, hold up. Do, do y'all see the court vision here? Because I don't know if y'all see the court vision here. Do y'all see what I just got into here? Watch his yow. Woo! <laughs> that is a steamer. I don't know why my yow stepped in. But that is an absolute dot. Dot's pretzels, man. That's what it is. Dot. It's good D. It's good D. No threes. And I feel like I got to play Infy like the, play I, the way I play Splash. No threes. But when he's shooting shots like that, sometimes... It's not always the easiest to do. We're leaking out. Get another dunk. We've got to keep the run going. Keep the momentum going. Because I don't know how long it's going to last. Because I see what Infy is doing, man. Like, what am I supposed to do there? That shot is so tough. What am I supposed to do? I'm boxed. I'm boxed. And... You'll notice, on the court, who do I have to score? Not many people. Manu, and that's about it. So, I mean, my Manu and Yao had to play the whole game because my bench power forward center's not great. Another free throw I'm missing. And a lot of it is I'm not comfortable with these guys. I mean, that that is part of it, but there's no real reason. I got to make free throws. Like, 
I'm not going to make excuses for it. I've got to find a way to make free throws. But on the flip side of things, even though my offense hasn't been great, he's not had nearly anything going for him. So as long as I continue to play good D, I'll be just fine. And I know Enfi doesn't want to mash. Like, he doesn't. Even AK on Yao. He does not want anything to do with mashing. My Manu gets a crazy chase down. Gets a block there as well. And after that possession, I it's it's over. Manu is the GOAT, man. There's no more debating it. Manu is the absolute GOAT after something like that. Get a good shot there. I just didn't agree in it. Got a great look, though. If I get a look like that, I'll take it. Because, I mean, look at the looks he's getting. I know he's greening more shots than me, but I feel like I'm getting better shots. Manu straight to the cup. And this is when I really realized, okay, I've got to do more with Manu. He is absolutely the real deal. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Manu might be the goat in my team. I've got to continue to get him the rock. It's good D. It's, I mean, I got to jump in that situation. It's pretty good defense, though, nonetheless. Jokic straight to the cup. That's a dot. It gave me a load up. They don't want to call a foul on that. I should get it back. I don't. And here's where I like, I'm like, okay, Algo is going to switch. You know something like that happens. Algo is going to switch. I don't get it on the reach. It's fine because I'm playing good defense playing good defense and I get it back. I know Algo's about to switch. So if I can get a stop like I just did, that's huge. He just so congested, so congested right there. Even getting the ball inbounds isn't easy versus a guy like Amphi. Another open leaner and I can't green it. That's a shot I've got to take because it's open. I'm just not greening enough shots right now. I'm playing immaculate defense. I'm just not greening as much as I probably need to. Terry on, uh, Terry in this type of matchup is not what I want. Thank you, got AK finally on him, in which we can get a little bumpy. That's fine. I'll live with it. You know, it's not an easy bucket, so at some stage, you got to just live with stuff like that because it's not an easy bucket at all. He has cut the deficit down. He was once down 12. He cut it. Somehow, Taco gets there. It's his ball. And at this stage, I'm rattled. I'm like, I've got to get Tim Thomas back in the game because I, I, with my second unit, I got no offense. But look at the defense. Look at the defense. Walk back with Ben. And I missed it. If I would green shots, I would be up way more. It's that simple. That could have been a bump. But it, it's, it, it, and that's why I've always said it. I don't like green or miss. The fact that I'm just slightly mistiming shots, I'm way out playing Enfy right now. And Enfy's started to play way better defense, so I'll give him credit where it's due. But I still feel like I'm out playing him, and I'm and I'm barely winning. Like I should be up 10 to 15 if I just green shots. And I gotta say, his defense really solid. Like I am boxed. There's no doubt about it. His rotations got me absolutely in a box. But in that same breath, guys, he's box two, gets that late in the in, late in the shot clock, I guess. I live with it. And we head into half, only up three. Like, I feel like I left a lot out there. And at this point, I wasn't that confident. To start the first half, we got TT coming off the screen. I'm thinking, why did I not shoot it the first time? So I shoot it the second time. Look, if he's not going to make an adjustment, honestly, I th why would Infamous step up on me? That's the first thing I want to say. What would be the point of him stepping up? I haven't greened anything yet. Why would he step up? It doesn't make sense. But does it? And I make him pay. It seems like Tim Thomas is going to have to do something in this second half. It's good D, man. It's good D, Manu. I mean, I don't know what I'm supposed to do there. Because I feel like that's perfect defense. And I don't get a stop. So, I mean, I guess. But should have been a stop. Manu trying to get by him, but he again, he's played really good defense here. At some stage, I'm just going to have to start going up with everything because I can't keep passing it out for him to rotate. I can't. I hate bailout. I hate bailout, man. 
If you want to take a shot like that, stand on it, man. Don't allow him to just bail out of it. It's good D, though. We're playing good defense right now. We are playing good defense right now. We are playing good defense right now. Back cut. Oh, my gosh. He was literally trying to foul me. If I'm just patient right here, we have an easy bucket or he's got to foul me. Just be patient on the back cut. I'm not. Still up six. We have a great start to the second half. Uh, we just got to keep extending it, man. Euro with Taco. Thank gosh it wasn't an and one. Got to keep it going. Ben, wide open leaner. I miss. When I'm, I didn't realize it when I played. But when I'm watching it back, I'm like, man, I miss so many good shots. And that's a swing right there. I could be up, up what, seven after that. Now I'm only up two. That's a swing if I've ever seen one. Because I give up a free two points on the other end. Just go up. I mean, he's a baby in there. And that's what I've got to realize with Minute is he's just a baby in there. And with the way the game is played, I've got to go up with shots like that. It's good D. He's so nervous. Even getting the ball across half court, so nervous. Just a second late. Another Euro step for Taco. Like, I guess, man. I guess. Only up to. I'm nervous right now. I ain't gonna lie. I'm nervous. It's a dot by him. By him. Oh, gosh. His possession's going nowhere. His possession's going nowhere. But guess what? Tim Thomas says, hold up. Watch me work. Just watch me work. You ain't got to do anything crazy. Just watch me work, says Tim Thomas. That's good D. It's good D all the way around right now. It's good D. He got nowhere to go. 10 on the clock. Nowhere to go right now. 10 on the clock. Nowhere to go right now. Hits Rick on the pop. I guess, man. I guess, like... That's great defense in my mind, but it's really not. Even there. The fact that Rick Smith is even close to getting a contest to me is crazy. Thank gosh he didn't. We're still up four. He's not comfortable getting the ball across half court. And that's the one thing, again, that I did all game long. He's not comfortable. I'm close to getting a steal on those. I hate bailout. I hate bailout. Because what am I supposed to do with something like that? I hate bailout. I'm thinking, okay, TT, we got to get our three back, TT. We got to get our three back, and that's exactly what we do. I told you guys I needed a big second half out of TT with the way he's playing defense, and at least I'm greening with him. This should be a stop. Like, what? Like, what, bro? What? At least it's good defense. 12 on a shot clock. This has to be a stop. Deflected out of bounds. I mean... From one thing to another, there's no way we're going to get a stop here. My confidence level of getting a stop here is at an all-time low. He throws it inbounds and it goes right to me. I don't know, but I don't ask questions. TT. Oh, I should have just shot it. I should have just shot it. I should have just shot it. Thank gosh. 2K bless me right there. And trust me when I tell you guys, I needed it right there. I needed it. That possession was going nowhere. Come on. He's uncomfortable. He's uncomfortable. We got to extend it going to the fourth. That's a stop. It's great defense. And with, with, with something like that, great defense. You live with whatever result happens there. Now, after that shot, I, I felt myself. I was feeling myself. because You know me. I'm not necessarily a three hunter. But after this shot, I was like, okay, I might have it today. Like, normally, I don't have it. But after this, an Asta into a open? I was like, okay, I might, I might got it. I might got it after that. Because that is a tough shot. And y'all see, Tim Thomas now has badge. Got him a new block. Got him a new block. Let's go. And y'all know I wanted to front run in this situation. Y'all know. I, want, I wanted to front run more than anything else. Obviously, it was box though. I'm boxed right now. I'm like, okay, TT, come here, man. Come here. Come here, TT. I need you right now. Uh-oh, boxed. I don't care, though. I need you right now. I mean, come on, man. I'm not even like that with Tim Thomas. If he went to his uh, menus and made some sort of an adjustment, I play D. 
I got a staff up to Team Thomas. Got contested, man. But up 11, headed into the fourth. And I needed it, man. I really did. Hey, TT. At this point, I was about to shoot anything. I'm not going to lie. Ooh, I could have shot that. We get a dunk with Manu. We're up 13 points in the fourth quarter. But I will say this. Even at this point, I wasn't comfortable because he's been crabbing me all game, been getting threes. And my main goal right now is just to not give up threes. Just don't give up threes at this stage. And I felt like I was going to win the game. Great defense. I don't care that he made that because in my mind, that's great defense. What else do you want me to do? But that's giving up a three. It went from 13 to 10 just like that. And I'm so mad at myself because I probably could have ended the game on that possession with a stop. Hey, TT, though. Hey, TT, could have shot it maybe. Oh, my, I'm cooking. I'm at least trying to cook. I'm not cooking, but I'm trying to. Absolutely boxed. Absolutely boxed. I get a wide open, but he's just too tired, and Bull Bull is there to save the day. If you don't think height runs the game, this is a prime example of how it does. I mean, even there, I'm tired with TT. Get a good shot, but I miss, and Bull Bull is there for the rebound. Just absolutely crazy. It's good D, though. No threes. Again, that's my only mindset right now. No threes. I should be fine. That's fine. Whatever. Take a tough two. That's not going to be. In every possession, my mind is get a good shot, but if not, work the shot clock. And that's the one that made me really mad. Turning the ball over like that is just inexcusable. You want to work the clock. There's three minutes left in the game. You don't want to play passive, but you don't want to do what I just did. He had it with Yao right there if he'd have just shot it. Good D though. Eight seconds. There's no way I give up a bucket here. This is a stop. This is a stop. Thank you, that's a stop. And a rebound. And at that point, I was like, finally, I got what I needed, right? Because I just gave up a turnover. I needed to stop desperately, and I got one. Hey, Ben. Just a little slow again. That's one I could green. 13% with the way I've been hoping I could have greened it. And at this stage, I didn't want to put Big Z in the game. Because, I mean, Big Z hadn't done anything all throughout the game. I was like, I don't want to put him in that type of situation. So I just had to ride with my guys. Three minutes left. Can I hold the lead? Uh, it's only eight. It went from, what, 13 to eight so far. Man, I, I just knew I just had to find a way to hold the lead. And it started with just taking time off the clock. That's, this defense is tough, man. Defense it is really tough. But that's my main goal. Just take time off the clock. Don't turn the ball over. I should be able to get the occasional bucket. Into TT. Okay, 14 on the clock now. Bull, bull. It's just not a good shot. It's great defense, not a good shot. Don't give up anything in transition is my goal here. If I give up some in transition, that's it's just going to change the whole game. Again, that's fine, right? Make him take a tough two. Now there's only two minutes left in the game. As long as I score on like one of the next three possessions, I should be fine. Because if I take time off the shot clock and just score one out of three, should be fine. Hey, Bobo. Out to TT. Great shot, finally. Keeping TT in the game pays off. Knocks down a shot there. Again, no threes. I don't give up threes. I'm going to win the game. That's my whole mindset right there. Thank gosh we didn't foul. Because again, 20 seconds came off. I won those 20 seconds by one point. At worst, you lose by two points and take 20 seconds off the game, off the game clock. That's fine. Like, that's the worst case scenario. Shouldn't have even attempted to shoot that. I am playing so rattled right now. I hate bailout. And I'm using it, and then I shoot that shot. I'm like, what am I doing? Honestly, like, what am I, what am I doing right now? That's not, that's not what I wanted to do. It's what I did do though. And uh, and and here we go, setting myself up for failure. He knocks down the shot, and just like that, I'm only up four. Literally in that, boom, nine point lead went to four. So I'm like, okay, I just got to take some time off the clock. Run your offense, take some time off the clock. Bull bull. Bang. I needed a big shot. Bulbul came through in a big time way. No threes right here. I'll win again. That's my mindset. No threes. I'll win again. And you guys can see that's how I'm playing. And then he has a great drag back with Manu. Anytime I feel like I get any sort of separation, he comes back and says, nope, 
No separation for you. I've got something. Even here, though, take some time off the clock. That's my main goal. Don't want to do anything crazy. Use all the clock and see what happens. Manu out to TT, and guess what? TT, who I think had four points at halftime, is up to 23 points. If there's one thing I learned from this game, TT is it at the shooting guard position. That's the one thing I learned. He takes a crazy shot. We get the board. And that basically did it. We secured the win. First Infamous, who is one of the best players, not only on PlayStation, but overall in my team right now. That's going to wrap it up for our video, guys. Drop a like on it. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. And have a blessed day.